guys welcome back to another vlog i actually miss vlogging i finally got my camera back for those of you who've been watching my vlog i was using my phone on the last two vlogs i took my phone not my phone i took my camera to best buy to get um get it fixed i'm actually about to do some skincare so don't mind the dryness going on but i took my camera to best buy and get it fixed because it was reading that no memory card so they replaced that entire little section where the memory card and battery goes all right so i'm actually multitasking because i have my tripod i'm probably gonna do a little skincare tiktok in the meantime as well um i started a new tiktok because i wanted i felt like my main tiktok has like a little bit of everything i love sharing everything what i'm cooking cleaning outfit of the day um grocery hauls clothing hauls just everything so i wanted to start a new tiktok just for skincare body care product reviews that way if you know opportunities come they can kind of see better what all i've done or used and stuff like that so all right so you guys are kind of seeing like the behind the scenes of me creating content right now so i'm gonna multitask so i wash my face in the shower hold on hey guys welcome back to another skincare routine so let's get my skin prepped for makeup so i'm looking super dry and i'm breaking out these two showed up but I'm not gonna let it get to me. I'm gonna do my skincare to get ready to put on just a minimal amount of makeup to go to the movies. All right, so I washed my face in the shower um, with the acne cleanser. Let me grab it. Hope it's wet, don't sleep. All right, so I washed my face in the shower with this cleanser. This is the one I've been using for my acne inkless list <laughs> salicylic cleanser for acne so now let's tone all right so i wash my face in the shower using the inkless salicylic cleanser this is the one i've been using for my acne it stays in the shower and now i'm gonna tone with this good molecules niacinamide brightening toner it has niacinamide vitamin c so i'm just gonna put a little bit of that And just wipe my face. <laughs> Multitasking, guys. So today is October 21st. I'm not sure when I'm posting this vlog. If I'm gonna wait till next week or if I can edit it and post it tomorrow instead. Alright, next I'm gonna go in with some hyaluronic acid. Focus, there you go. Just some hyaluronic acid. All right, next I'm gonna go in with my hyaluronic acid, add some moisture back into my skin. Let that absorb for a little bit. So yeah, today is the 21st of October. We're gonna go see the new the Rock movie. Yeah, what is it called? Black Black Adam. We haven't been to the movies since probably over two months. So I wanted to go to the movies that came out. So I'm like, let's go. Like I'm ready to go to the movies. So what I do today, as you guys know, I feel like if I don't get out of the house, I don't have content. So <laughs> that's what I'm doing. So I'm gonna do my skincare. What else we're gonna put on? So next serum is this is the same routine I do every single day guys so you probably already seen this um, going with the good molecules this coloration serum next I'm gonna go in with the good molecules this coloration serum and I'm gonna do a sheet mask just to hydrate my skin because you guys know dry skin and dry weather and going outside so I'm gonna do a sheet mask real quick as well. And I also need to do my hair. So I just washed my hair as well in the shower. So I'm just gonna do like a low bun, mid part bun. That has been, there's two things I've been doing a lot lately, which is the low bun. And I like the way it makes my face look. <laughs> it just look, <laughs> So I like that. <laughs> so low bun and then last week I did like a puff. 
I, I think I put, yeah, there's a clip of it on my TikTok. And the sheet mask. Um, so yeah, I did that high puff, but before I put it up in a puff, I did um, just rate the gel through like a wash and go, but like really fast. Didn't sit there and shingle or anything like that. So I did that and um, I love the way it looked too. So I'm like, why am I sitting here spending three hours doing a wash and go? Put it in a high puff. And at night, I just took the string out and kind of just tie it up. And it pretty much stayed fresh till how many days? Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Yeah, it lasted about four or five days before my hair really felt dry, but I pushed it through and made it to today because I was like, I'm going out today. I want to wash it today. So yeah, sheet mask. This one is the Sephora Collection Hydrating and Anti-Pollution Mask. Just these little sheet, um, sheet masks. Sephora sale is also coming up. So if you want to get stuff like this, that is the time to get it. These are already cheap, but <clears throat> get a couple extra. Look at that moisture like. Do you see that? Hold on. <laughs> Let me show it on the TikTok. Look at that moisture, all that juice. Ooh. So yeah, um, Sephora sale coming up, waiting for that. I love these and I love the ones from Neutrogena. I haven't had the ones from Neutrogena in a while. Oh, I did a full skincare on here before showing how I prep my skin for makeup. So, pretty much the same. All right, so now the drill, get a little extra juice left over, put it on my hands, because my hands are super, super dry. So yeah, probably go to Target as well. You know how it is. Target run. While that sits on my face, I'm gonna moisturize the rest of my body. Um. Finishing out, I just picked this up and realized I had like a little bit drop, like literally a drop left in there. So I'm going to finish that one so I can open up the new one. Um, where is it at? Okay, so I picked up a new one a couple weeks ago because they had a sale like 30, 40% off or something. So I went ahead and picked up the full size because I was like, winter, fall, dry skin. <laughs> I refuse to be dry this fall. So pick this up um so yeah i'm finish this out moisturize myself i gotta figure out outfit to wear just keep it simple nothing fancy i need a shop i feel like i need a shop <laughs> but when i say i need a shop come on now when i say i need a shop i just need a couple more basics um i need a couple of those full leather pants some more neutral like um basic tops that are like fall nudes the burnt orange the greens just those little basic stuff i'll look around each of them today and see if i see any and then the full leather pants because for full leather pants i feel like i only have a black and i have a old like maroon color from zara but i need the browns <laughs> the flare pants just those basics that you can pretty much wear all season so that's what i mean when i say i have to shop I really need a lot just need a couple more basics so yeah let me do those couple little things then i'll come back and show you guys what i'm wearing today so yeah all right my hair is done i tied it down so i can lay down while i put on a minimal <laughs> you guys know the deal amount of makeup um i forgot to grab foundation or something what should i do no no foundation makeup I think I'm gonna do no foundation makeup today. I'm trying to think. So let me grab a concealer. All right, let's do a no foundation makeup today. So I'm just gonna use the Fenty Beauty Focus. 
Fenty Beauty um, concealer, which is almost like my skin tone. And I'm just gonna cover these two little dark spots that I got. Um, not a lot, just a little spot. And I'm also gonna put this same shade under my eye just to kind of look more awake. So, see I brought it up. That's pretty much it. Looking for any dark spot and just pop that on there. I'm gonna use a brush and just blend those into the skin. Just to kind of, oh, my bad, didn't know the camera got dark. Now let me switch my camera real quick because it's gonna drive me insane. All right, so then I'm gonna use my damp beauty blender and blend the concealer. I was just gonna say I have no mirror, but I forgot. Yeah, this little palette. I told you guys, I'm so lazy with my makeup. It just feels like I'm always rushing. Always rushing and can never sit down for a good two hours and beat the face. Be brighten my face a little bit and then I'm just gonna powder. Just kind of going over everything. You guys can see right there, right, right there. So see? Not bad at all. Might put a little bit more right there. Cause you still want to make it look skin like. So just cover the dark spot, blend it all out real good. Set your face. And it will look like you put in way more effort than you actually did. But for the other one, I'm gonna use the Sephora brand. Um what do you call this again? Beat something? micro smooth powder and um, like I said earlier if you want some of these Sephora products that sale is coming up next week hopefully this video is up before then I think it should be I'm gonna do another what's in my Sephora cart video There you go. I'm gonna pop on just a tad of this bronzer slash contour, like literally a little dab. Define the cheekbones a little bit. I feel like, yeah, sometimes I think I don't see it, but then when you go to take pictures, that thing be like bam, bam, bam. A little bit of that, find the cheeks. Okay. I'm gonna spray my face in a little bit, but let's brush the brows out. Like all I'm doing is literally running errands and then the movies. Um, there's literally nothing in here. I need to pick up another one of these. Anastasia. If they still have it. Alright. Uh, mascara. Wait. I'm going to pop a little bit of brown shadow on the eyes. From... Jackie's palette. It's a little brown. This is literally the best brown ever. I actually show up. Literally just enough to show. Something on the eyes. Pop some mascara on. 
I really need to learn how to do lashes because I feel like when I see the girls put on just a lash. But ooh, I've been sleeping on this mascara. So old mascara, but ooh. Okay, this is one layer. Okay then. I gotta show you guys in a second. Sorry guys if it sounds like I'm whispering a little bit. I'm in the bathroom, I don't want it to echo a lot. And Mike is like taking an hour nap. Let me show you guys what this mascara did. Look at that. I look like I have a little baby lash. From the side, do you see that? And that's one layer. Wow. <laughs> I was all up in the camera on that one. I'm gonna put a little bit more and see if I can get it. Especially the edge. Yep. All right, mascara on, that's on. I think for the lip, I wanna go bold. So I have, light so I think for the lips I want to go bold I have these two lip pencils. so I think I'm gonna go with this one um, this one is more red again old very old products that I have yeah, this one is like red red this one is more deep it is fall it's time to go deep We'll use it as a lighter. It's more purpley. So I might go in with another color on the middle just to kind of. too purpley. Mm -hmm. Alright. That is what we have. I don't even have blush on. Put another color in the middle to kind of match the pants a little bit better. But let me get dressed, do my little outfit of the day for TikTok, and come back. All right, guys, full outfit of the day. Just got a little tank top on. I'm probably not gonna keep this on right now. I got these maroon, whatever color you call this. I love the way these two colors look together. Some sandals <laughs> and Mike's little shirts. I gotta tie my hair back down because it's not dry. But I just wanted to give you guys a little outfit of the day. So I'll check back in with you guys once I'm on the road, see what I'm doing, what I'm up to. All right, guys, I am currently in Vegas, about to go eat with this one right here. Made an appearance in my vlog. Got anything to say? Hurry up, I'm hungry. <laughs> About to go to Bonefish Grill. You guys can see it. There you go. Damn. The Zoom is silent now. Why? It's a good question. Yep, Bonefish Grill, been a minute. Let's go get some Bang Bang Shrimp. Mm -hmm. And yeah, just wanted to do a quick check in. This sun is like. Mm. Anyway, guys, I'll come back after this one eats. Stop being angry. Go record me real quick. Hmm? I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So go now.
Good morning guys. It is the next day. It is Saturday. Getting a really late start to my day. So I woke up cramping so I'm not really in the mood to do anything today. So it's probably going to be a more, which I wanted it to be anyway. I like for my Saturdays slash the day before I go back to work to be um, very relaxing, very the less work the better because I just feel like when you have so much to do next thing you know it is 10 o'clock at night and you're rushing to go to sleep and you're so tired so I try my best to like not have a lot to do on Saturday so for example I did laundry yesterday I still have a load to go put away um, it's getting windy the temperature is about to change finally probably gonna feel like fall in the morning or it probably already does <laughs> So whenever, the way we also know when the temperature is changing in Nevada is like, you get a dust storm slash a very windy day, and then the next day is cold or the next day is hot, whichever way it's gonna go. Cozy day, that's exactly what it's about to be. Um, so yeah, I figured I'll jump on real quick, catch you guys up. The movie was amazing last night. We went and saw Black Adam. I think I said it, I don't remember if I did. It was amazing, it was good. It was a lot of action. Um, I gave it like an 8 out of 10 because I said I wanted him to like talk more. He did a lot of staring. <laughs> but I think that's what the character was anyway. Um, my husband Mike, he gave them a 9 out of 10. So, good. We went to H&M because I told you guys that, I think I did. Yeah. We have a baby shower to go to which sucks because now I'm not feeling 100%. Um, so I went to H&M. <laughs> Picked up another necklace because I just feel like all my necklaces keep getting whatever it's just a easy yesterday when I needed gold necklace I couldn't find any um, so H&M didn't have as many baby stuff that I wanted them to get but um, let me take this off. I found this set of like just basics I think they're newborns to USA three months just some basic little onesies with the buttons at the bottom comes in this nice set of three um gray white and blue thought that was cute love that um i thought they would have more because i really haven't like never really looked at the baby section inside h&m so i thought they were gonna have like more baby related stuff but they only had a couple of outfits um this set i thought was cute i think it's newborn uh, it comes with the little hat, the little pants, and the onesie, which I'm sure, yeah, it's like a side onesie thing. And this was not bad either. This was 20 for the set. Um, I wish I could get more stuff, but I probably still will get her something later on from the, like her, uh, what is it called? I'll probably get her something else from her registry before she has the baby or by the time she has the baby. Um, it's my co-workers, my supervisor's daughter, and she's dog sit before for us. We've taken pictures for her before as well. So, yeah. And then I wanted to get something else to go with the clothes. So I found this pack of cute bib little things. They're Mickey Mouse. Comes with this neutral one, this blue one and then that colorful print so that's what i got i need to go to walmart real quick and find a cute little bag and then mike got his own gift i'm not sure if he's gonna make it because he has to work but he got his own gift he got these two pants which i thought were cute they're like jeans but not really jeans soft material this brown and this blue um, this was not bad price either. I keep breaking out the adjustable waist and stuff. But, um, yeah, two little pants. And then these tops, I believe, can go with them. Yeah, they can go with them. Comes with this little one. It says the Lion King. This one is six months. So, has a little while. Six months. And then the Lion King brown one. Thought that was cute that he got his own little gift. 
which I thought was sweet. So yeah, I need to go find two cute little bags to put that in. And then if I see anything else in Walmart, I'll add it to it. But like I said, I'll see what she has on her registry. I didn't have time. And then from there, I'll probably grab something later. So that's the plan. I have the baby shower too. But I want to open up a package with you guys. I don't know if you guys can see. But I got a new toaster. You know you're like adulting when you get excited for things like a new toaster. So I had this toaster in my... Well, we knew we are going to need a new toaster because we've had this little black one. Like just a basic, I don't even know what brand it was no markings on it really janky little stuff falling out of it right now um for a long time so i knew i wanted a toaster and i knew i wanted like the double toaster under yeah can you see let me turn it this way so i know i wanted like double you can be toasting four pieces of toast bagel bread whatever it is I knew that was like the first thing I wanted, double. So I went on between Amazon and Bed Bath & Beyond. I found this one on Bed Bath & Beyond. It's the Cuisinart Custom Select 4 Slice Toaster. Um, what I loved about this one, because they had so many different ones, this one was a little bit more pricey. Um, but what I loved about this was that there was a there was a selection for whatever bread you wanted. So I'll show you guys. As you can see here, it has bread, bagel, waffle, pastry, English muffin. So it literally had everything you could possibly want to toast. And I also believe you can defrost. So you can defrost. If you're only using one side, I think you can press single. Um, again, same thing on both sides. This pushes it down. And then this is your um, level of toast on your bread and stuff. So from one to seven, which is a pretty good selection. You don't have to be wondering on the time once you figure out what you like. So yeah, I'm gonna open that up, but I'm also gonna do a TikTok. You guys know the dealio. I'm gonna do a cute TikTok or just get some clips with my phone real quick so I can make a TikTok. You know, doubling up the content. You know, this is how you have to do it as a content creator you have to find multiple ways to make content so, all right so here we go i can't zoom out anymore so this is what it looks like it is so nice Ooh. it is so nice i wish it came in black but they didn't have black in this exact style but love that i have a button for everything because most of them will have like bread and bagel or just bread just different things like that and i was like well it doesn't have this and it doesn't have that so love that i was wondering if it had the little crumb tray but it's actually back here they're so cute small little trays love that so it has two of the little catch tray in the back and yeah that's my new toaster and funny thing, this little black one started smoking yesterday or started burning Mike's bread and he was like, okay, we need a new toaster. And I was like, took me less than five minutes because I literally already had this one in the safer later and five bread types, seven shades of single slice. Yeah. Yeah. So once he said it smoked yesterday, I was like, okay, fine. I will pay it. But I got lucky also because um, Bed Bath & Beyond had their 20% coupon. And so I was able to save 20% plus a little $5 reward thing. So I did get a, around $15 off. So that made me feel a little better. A little bit better. <laughs> um, but yeah, in case you guys interested interested in a new toaster, I will link this one down below. I picked up another thing, but I might have to take it out of the box and then I'll show you guys a clip. So give me a few minutes. Let me rearrange. I'm going to do that one in the bathroom. So this is what I picked up. I picked up a towel warmer. Got a little bougie. 
This is the box that it came in and I almost forgot to come back and show you guys. I already put it on the floor where I'm gonna have it most of the time. But this is what it looks like. This is the lid. I love that sleek, neutral white. This is how big it is. It should be able to fit um, two full size like towels in there. Just kind of roll them a little bit. Um, it has the on and off button. I thought these were seconds, but they're actually minutes. So 15, 30, 60, and 90 minutes. Um, so before I go in the shower, I'll just turn it on, put it on timer, put my towel or robe or pajamas in it. And the brand is called Haven. I got that one from Bed Bath & Beyond, but Amazon had a lot of them. I've been wanting it for like two years. <laughs> I've wanted one for like two years, but I kept talking myself out of it because I'm like, girl, that is like bougie. You don't need a towel warmer. But <laughs> it's a struggle when it's during the cold weather where you're like going from a nice warm shower and you know that feeling you open the door it's literally freezing cold uh, your clothes is cold it's just a little extra but self-care means taking care of yourself and treating yourself so this is me treating myself honestly I was also able to save a lot of money on it so Bed Bath & Beyond so initially it was like about 140 they had it on sale then I had 20% off 80 and then what else? Yeah, it was on sale plus the 20% off 80. So I got it down to I think 80 something, which was really, really good. So that made me feel a lot better spending like 80 bucks on it. They have different sizes and stuff on Amazon. So you can kind of look around, see if you like, if you're looking for something like that. Um, but I thought this would be the perfect size because like I said, my robes, pajamas, towels, I might even throw the underwear in there with the towel and everything just to get everything warm and cozy. I'll see what time I like the most, whether I like the 15, 30 or whatever. And then I went into the store. I wanted one of these last time I was there for the tub. It is a spa pillow with neck and shoulder support um so i think it's adjustable because you have the yeah it's adjustable you can um clip off the neck part and kind of put it where you need it and then you have the back support or you can keep them together has the suction cups on the back right there to stick it onto the tub and then it comes with this so you can hang it if you want it to dry. So I probably would put a little clip somewhere here where I can hang it and just let it kind of, you know, air out when I'm not using it. Um, but yeah, this was also on sale. So initially this was $30 when last time I went to Bed Bath & Beyond. They're also on Amazon. But since I was already there, I ran inside. Um, so $30, it was on sale for $22, and I was also able to use another 20% off a single item. And so I only spent like $19 on it, which makes me happy. If I save money while treating myself, just makes it better. So I'll pick this pillow up as well, and it's by the same brand, Haven. So I guess they have a lot of spa stuff, robe stuff, and whatever. So yeah, I'm looking forward to using that. I'm probably going to use it today. Um, but yeah, I'll show you guys a clip in another vlog or something of me trying the towel warmer, but I'll link it down below too. Um, Bed Bath & Beyond always have sale. I know they're going through their struggles, but they always have good sale and just finding little things like this. So yeah, like I said, I'm just going to relax. I'm cramping. I'm miserable. So I'm just going to relax for the rest of the day. Hope you guys enjoyed this little mini vlog. I know it still adds up in time by the time I edit all these clips. But yeah, this was my weekend. Pretty low key. I'm off next weekend. So I might have more footage then for the next vlog. But yeah, that's it for this week. Hope you guys enjoy this vlog. And I'll see you in my next one.